Welcome YouTube, Bobby G here. Thanks for joining me. Today I'd like to discuss my quest for an increased pH level. My target pH would be between 8 and 8.2. I'm fortunate that where I live, our tap water is very close to 8. So you might ask what the problem is. For months I've been testing my pH regularly along with other parameters of the water and I was generally around 7.4 and if I stretched my eye I could convince myself maybe it was a little bit higher but in reality it was at 7.4. My fish have been you know very colorful and um, you know, so some people would question whether it's worth increasing the pH and, and changing things when things already look good. Uh, but my thought is that I would like to make the water conditions optimal for the fish that I keep. So back to my water being at 7.4, you know, after doing some research, uh, I had a large piece of driftwood in the center of the tank, uh, which I've replaced, you can see here, with some rock. And I thought for certain that this would solve my problem. Well, after removing it and doing some water changes, I found there to be very little difference. It may have been a little closer to 7.6, but not much. So the next thing I tried was, I thought if I added a bag of uh, aragonite, Caribsea aragonite, uh, a 15 pound bag, that, uh, that this would also help. Um, so I, I went out and bought a bag of it, I brought it home, and I literally rinsed it in the sink for over an hour and a half. I stuffed my spray wand down into the bottom of the pail and was swishing it around and rinsing it what seemed like forever. Uh, I thought I could get it to a point where the water was running clear out of it, but that never happened. Uh, although I am glad I rinsed it because it was extremely dusty when I got it. So anyways, it, it got not too bad. So I decided, okay, I'll, I'll pour it in the aquarium. Um, I did it you know, slowly, little scoops at a time, and I mixed it into my uh, current substrate, which was uh, pool filter sand, and uh, which, uh, you know, in my opinion, I, I think it looks really nice. Uh, the fish seem to love it, you know, they, they like to uh, dig around and make little uh, pits and mounds. Um, so anyways, I mixed in the, the uh, new um, aragonite, and it looked very similar to my pool filter sand, so you know you wouldn't notice the difference. It's about the same size uh, granule, um, and so then you know after doing, uh, I let that sit overnight, and it, you know the water cleared up. It was it was nice and crystal clear again, and I thought, okay, well now's the time to do a water test again. So I test the water. And, you know, sure enough, it had risen a little bit, but not a whole lot. Um, you know, I, I was at, you know, uh, safely at 7.6, but I had hoped for a little bit uh, better result. Um, so I continued doing my water changes, like I said. Uh, and the last water change I did was about 80%. Uh, because I felt that if I replaced enough of the aquarium water with the tap water that's at eight, uh, that maybe my aquarium would, would uh, uh, the pH would increase and, and hold. Um, so, you know, sure enough, it, it did rise a little bit, and but it still wasn't where I wanted it. And so the last thing I've done is I've added 
three tablespoons of baking soda, and so what I'm I, what I'm wondering is, will the pH hold? I did raise the pH to an eight, and the, the question is now, will it hold at eight with the aragonate that I've got in there? Uh, my feeling would be if it doesn't hold at eight, it would simply mean I don't have enough aragonite. And uh, it, at that point, you know, I may decide to uh, change out my substrate. I have a couple options, uh, you know, add more aragonite uh, or change out my substrate to uh, Carob C African Cichlid Mix. Um, and I would add a bag of uh, Sahara sand and a bag of white and mix them together because I think that would be a, a good look. Um, so anyways that's uh, that's the progress on, on my uh, pH and uh, I'm fairly satisfied with the results so far um, but I will continue to update uh, in the comments uh, whether the pH holds. So. I appreciate you spending this time with me today. Feel free to comment, ask questions, and please like and subscribe and share. Let's talk again. Make today awesome.